of the low salutations what to do with start the game or all father do rag game no vibes like scrap let's get it what's up happy thursday do rag nation we are back once again live just youtube today going to have a little fun we got a little special stream we're going to be talking a little marvel's venom i'm going to continue my playthrough of new game plus and i got some new toys to play with thanks to elgato i could finally talk about that very excited as as a lot of you probably know i use a lot of elgato products i've been looking forward to uh, getting a chance to work with them for a while now and they finally noticed your boy they sent me some goodies for me to play around with they got this new uh, neo series of products and so we're going to be showing off a little bit of that while we play a little spider-man how's everyone feeling today what's up co-fish zero plays no cap spidey evolution what's up what's up mr 600 how is everyone feeling what's up what's up idk bro what it do Hope everyone is feeling nice and dandy on this fine Thursday. What's up, Dre? Hayden Patrick. What's up? Feels like, I don't know, every time I go live now, it feels like it's been a while since the last time I went live, which it probably has been, actually. I've been, <laughs> I've been doing more videos lately. So Fabricio, shout out to Brazil. Viva la Brazil. What's up, Bricks Unlimited? So random to cool experiment news complete new game plus three times uh we did we actually do have some i was gonna make that news video but then i remembered i have to uh do this uh elgato showcase so i was like all right i'll save the news video for later i'll do a spider-man 2 stream and we'll talk about some of the stuff and i'll play around with the with the uh gear as well but yeah i'm gonna have a shorter news video I was waiting for more info from Insomniac, but I have something. I have enough to uh, make a short video for uh, Super News Bits. But yeah, there is a new Spider-Man 2 update coming. There's a new patch coming. How you doing now with Flo? What's up, our angel? What's up, our angel? Shout out to, uh, speaking of Archangel, shout out to X-Men 97. I finally got caught up. <laughs> I was determined to not watch any of X-Men 97 until I finished X-Men 92. That was very important to me. I had to binge watch X-Men 92 all five seasons before I started X-Men 97. I got a late start, so I missed like the first five episodes of 97. But I managed to binge watch all of X-Men 92 and all five episodes of X-Men 97 before episode six dropped. <laughs> it was, it was crazy, but well worth the effort. X-Men 97 is absolutely peak. I love it. Uh, they did a big, especially coming directly from 92. 97 is incredible. I literally went right from 92 right into 97 like i had it lined up perfectly just for a week straight binge watching all of 92 then i went from season the end of season five right into 97 watched all five episodes that were available it was incredible i love it why is bacon called bacon and cookies called cookies when you cook bacon and bake cookies one of life's great mysteries that you only really think about when you're high. <laughs> well, if you think about it, baking itself is a form of cooking. If you wanted to be technical, you cook cookies as well. You fry bacon. You could also bake it. I know there are I know there are people who advocate for 
the proper way to make bacon is to actually bake it in the oven, not fry it on a pan. Whereas cookies, you always have to bake them. Whoever did Storm theme, whoever whoever did Storm's everything needs a raise. The new outfit, that whole scene, the thing, mm. <laughs> perfection, perfection. Having a game for Venom and having more than one combo would be fire. Yeah, yeah, I definitely will. I definitely enjoy playing as Venom in Spider Man Two, but yeah, a full Venom game where you get like a bunch of different abilities, the ability to free roam. That's what we really want. That's that will satisfy that itch. I'm I'm looking forward to it. New Transformers one. I I checked out on Transformers like 10 movies ago. <laughs> I think I think the last I think the last Transformer movie I saw was the second one. The only one I remember is the Megan Fox one. I literally just checked out <laughs> of the whole series. <laughs> Was Tyrese in one of them? <laughs> I, I completely checked out that series after I think I watched. Well, I think Shia, Shia LaBeouf was in the first two. And then he had his uh, issues and then they got rid of him, I think. I, I have not been keeping up. I know they teased a, a G.I. Joe crossover. But I have not been keeping up. Prototype Blueprint. Funny enough, they were actually going to make... Prototype was originally going to be a Venom game. The idea originally was to have an open-world Venom game. But instead of doing Venom, they pivoted into a new into an original IP and just converted it into a Venom game. So it's only right for Insomniac to then turn around and give us a Venom game, that kind of reminds us of Prototype. It all comes full circle. So, like I said, we got some new toys to play around with. Uh, shout out to Elgato. Big fan of them. They sent me some new swag. Actually, more than swag. They sent me some equipment. I got a new capture card here. The Game Capture Neo, which I can use to play some spider-man 2 for you guys audio works picture is up so so the capture we got the capture card it is working nice literally just plugged it in no issues if you're a aspiring content creator or streamer you might want to get in on this I got me the, I got me the capture Neo and I got a new key light. So we're going to be playing around with that as well. Could be more anticipated than Spider-Man 2 was. I don't know about that, but it's definitely, the Venom game is definitely going to be more anticipated on that level, I'd say. Or definitely more anticipated than Miles Morales. People have been really waiting for a Venom game. I'd say a Venom game would be on par with Marvel's Wolverine in terms of hype, potentially. Because Venom is like a very popular character. You have the Elgato HD60 and Wave Mike. Yep. Yeah, I had the I had the HD60 S. I got the I got the Wave Mic. I got the uh, Elgato green screen, but I don't. I have a Logitech camera and I have some Amazon uh, lights. But now I got the new Neo capture card. The whole thing about the Neo series is that they're supposed to. They're emphasizing user friendly. So if you're if you're a new content creator, you don't know anything about any of this. It's the whole series of design to make it as easy as possible for you and also be cheaper. 
So let's take a, let's test uh let's take out the light. This key light. Cause I like my lights, but I wanna see if uh we we can uh mess with the the Elgato key light. Cause the ones I have are like stands. Like they're literally just light stands that you hang on that you just stand up behind my uh, computer. Playing Spider-Man 2 right now. There's, can you believe there are people... I saw someone on Twitter. They uh, shared a screenshot. They've put 400 hours into Spider-Man 2. That's insane. <laughs> 400 hours into Spider-Man 2 is nuts. What's my What's my playtime? 89 hours. So I'm crazy, but I'm not that crazy. <laughs> but I'm 89 hours deep into Spider-Man 2. 400 hours is insanity. You put it 205 hours, that's wild. <laughs> How much hours will I put into Venom? Probably similar. I think I ended up. Let me check my Miles Morales. So you can I check that? So I got 43 hours in Miles Morales. I think we can I think we could probably double that for Venom. Eighty to a hundred hours for Venom seems about right. What's up, Craig? How you doing, my boy? Appreciate you hanging out. You like Harry to stay Venom? You would like to see him transform in and out of the bulky form? I definitely want a new Venom host. Uh, I th I feel like for Harry, they're setting up maybe a Hobgoblin for him in Spider-Man 3 based on how the game ended. And I would much rather have... Uh, them bringing Eddie Brock or Flash Thompson for a standalone Venom game. I would like to see an Somniac's interpretation of those characters. All right, we unbox the uh, Key Light Neo. Let's see how easy this is to put together. Less than 19 inches. That's tough. All right, we got the key light Neo. Let's see how easy this is to put together. Got our cords. Riot as the villain. Yeah, Riot was some of the cut content for Spider-Man 2, I believe. They had Riot. They had uh, some additional Venom. They, they had a bunch of Venom moves and stuff that were in the concept phase that didn't make it into the game. They had Riot. They had a whole scene where Symbios attacked the Daily Bugle. Of course, they had a whole Miles Morales being infected by the symbiote. Yeah, there was a bunch of stuff that didn't make it into uh, the final game. You wanted them to bring in Null? Yeah. Yeah, because the villain for a Venom game, I feel like, has to be pretty crazy. That's why I was thinking they'd do Carnage. Null kind of seems a little too of big in scale, I feel like. For a standalone Venom game, like Noel is like crazy. 
So I don't know if they'll go that far. But Carnage definitely makes sense. Especially, uh, especially with Venom coming out after that DLC. Maybe you have the Carnage DLC set up the Venom spinoff game. Because it, because when you bring Carnage in, people aren't going to want to just it be a one and done thing. People are going to want to fight Carnage more. They're going to want more of Carnage. They're not going to be satisfied with just one DLC appearance. So you like introduce him in the DLC and then have that lead into the spin -off, the Venom spinoff game and then Venom fights Carnage in that game. That I think that would I think that would work out. Release date, uh you definitely don't expect this before twenty twenty seven. My understanding is that Wolverine is going to be the next Marvel game from Insomniac that comes out. Cause that was supposed that was originally the plan. Obviously everything got derailed by the hack. But they were originally planning to get Wolverine out by twenty twenty five, potentially twenty twenty four. But that's probably moved up to twenty twenty six for Wolverine. Best case scenario. Maybe 20, late 2025 if they can swing it. I would not count on it though. Plans Venom made you want to. Would you want a Hulk game? I feel you. We're definitely overdue for a Hulk game. Okay. Oh, that's bright. MJ said there's a shop in Little Odessa that might have a lead on Craven. Okay, I just plugged in the Keylight Neo. And holy, this is bright. Look at this. This gets bright. <laughs> holy. Shout Delgado. <laughs> I feel like I just, I feel like I just opened the box in uh, Pulp Fiction. <laughs> look how bright this, look how bright this light is. I have the power. <laughs> That's crazy. Shout to Elgato for this uh, key light Neo. This is this is nuts. Uh, it's got a dial. <laughs> got the these def these are definitely the villain lights. Now you know you know uh, Dragon Ball Z when uh, they have a beam clash and someone gets overwhelmed and loses the beam clash. And then they get slowly consumed by the by the beam, and then it, they get covered in all the light. This literally, this is what it looks like. Gallant gun, uh, no, it's too powerful. Uh. <laughs> it, just gets, it just gets too bright. <laughs> Holy, this is bright as hell. This is dope. And it's got a it's got a knob here, so you can uh, cr so you can turn it down. <laughs> it looks so futuristic. Oh, let me turn this all the way off. 
turn this all the way down. So you can see so you can see it. Cause you, you can't see it at all when I crank it up. <laughs> this shine shines like a diamond. Is Dragon Ball Durag the Durag Nation anthem? Oh no. We don't we don't have a the, the uh, technically the Durag Nation anthem right now is my set out the gamer intro song that I made oh, a while ago. I haven't updated the uh, anthem. Currently that currently that is Durag Nation national anthem. Hey what it do make the like button blue. But Dragon Ball are ambassadors at uh, Akira Toriyama Sensei is getting a statue built in his honor. Will Rivals be playable on the Valve Steam Deck? I'm not sure. You'll have to check the, uh, beta, the uh, alpha page. I think they have some info on there about the requirements. Cyborg is overdue for a game. I don't, I don't know about that. A cyborg game. I'd be skeptical of a Teen Titans game. On the other hand. Now we're talking. Now we're talking lang my language. So now I got to see how I'm going to mess with this light. I want to mount it on my computer. All right, that was easy. Just screwed this on. Then I think I mounted. So I want to mount this right back here. Figure out how to mount this thing. Then we'll unleash the light. A Marvel DC team up game. Yeah, people have been talking about that for like years. Some kind of crossover. It's a cool it's a cool concept. I don't know how practical it would be to make that happen. All right, so I got the I just put the the key light neo next to my camera it's right next to my face cam so I already have lights so let me uh, test out the lighting let's turn off the lights are you afraid of the dark that was a great show all right so lights are off lights are off in my office turned off my streamer lights so we're only going to be relying on the light of the Elgato Neo let's see what this looks like 
when I crank it. Holy, that's bright. That is that is a bright boy. So that's pretty good. Need a little more light though. Cause it because I need it because I need it to fully I need to fully bring out Oh, you can change the color. Hey, okay, that's even better. All right. All right, now it's perfect. So, with just with just the key light neo Perfectly gives me the perfect amount of lighting that I need for my setup to to highlight this green screen. So it's not artifact or anything like that. All right, definitely a dub. And then if I wanted to be OD, I added another light. I don't even I don't even need it. Uh, so big shout out to Elgato for hooking your boy up. I am definitely messing with this uh with this uh, Neo series. Loving the key light. Definitely check out Elgato. If you're if you're an aspiring content creator or you do remote work, you you have a job where you have to do Zoom meetings or anything like that, definitely gonna to want to check out some Elgato products so you can look nice and professional. This is a dub. Yeah, the, the key light was pretty easy to set up. You see I did it right out the box. Gotta find Craven and that serum. And it's doing step, the head to little Odessa. It's doing the work of the two giant lights that I got off of Amazon. And all I had to do was just connect this right to the top of my com computer right next to my face cam. Yeah, now with Fly, I definitely recommend uh messing with this. Yeah. The the Neo series just is a uh, new. Uh this is the date that we were allowed to talk about it. But I think they're gonna be available tomorrow. You need a PC, your MacBook ain't doing it. Your MacBook ain't doing that. I love my Mac. My Mac has been carrying me these two years as a content creator. People keep saying you gotta get a PC or they're surprised when I tell them I don't have a PC. I've never, like I used to have, and I used to have a PC forever. I was always a PC guy. And then once I got the Mac, I never looked back. <laughs> Once you go Mac, you never go back. Only thing I want a PC for is the mods. And of course the uh, Marvel Rivals baited the uh, closed alpha test for Marvel Rivals. Outside that, I really have not felt the need. I may have 
just found the world's smallest thief. Black Hat Noir secured. Let's uh, uh let's. with the lash go back to that one a deathstroke standalone game could work for sure i mean most stand a lot a lot of standalone games could work for for these dc characters I think Deathstroke in particular has a lot of uh, potential, is a lot of potential fodder for interesting content, but it comes down to who's making it and how it's executed. Of course, that's the most important thing. Because we all know he's an interesting character. But, you know, what would that game look like? Move this way. Venom game, we need it. We, we will. Mike is too close, there we go. Yeah, I've been waiting for a Venom game for a while. I'm definitely looking forward to it. I know people. I know there's some people who are uh, hating on the Somnet because it's cool now, but. What happened, Hunters? Has it been coming? I love Spider-Man too, despite his flaws. Spider-Man, a uh, Venom, a Venom game. Nah. Could you tell me? Miles Morales style. I'm very excited it, to try uh, that. Almost killed me. Cannot help you. Do I think the invincible game will be before. good? I Please hope it's going to be wait. good. I can protect you from the hunters. I'm not worried about them. I like. I love the idea I saw I of a triple A game made by a smaller team. This is his jungle now. I think more triple A studios should take that off. into account because that's where we, that's when we got our best games when studios were smaller. When everything got bloated and all these out-of-touch executives got involved, you okay? hey, Miles. Actually, never felt better. That's when that's when AAA started falling Wait. off. Really? Positive. Hey, let me call you back. Got some bonfires. To so crash. the fact that they want to make a AAA uh, okay. game and they're and they're using established industry veterans, but they're keeping this the team small. Sounds like less than 40 people. I think that's great. Because Power World, they only had a team of like 50 people. But you don't need a, you don't need 500 people to make a good game. That's when things just start getting, you know, real spooky.
they doing up here? Vodka from Volgograd? Transformers one trailer was epic. A party. I might check it out. I wonder what they're celebrating. To be honest, we replayed the Venom so many times. Rude of Craven not to extend an invite. I don't think anyone would deny that. Before, though. That mission was absolute peak when it happened. I wish we had more, obviously. That yeah, that, I think that was the most disappointing thing. Like you can definitely tell, and they admitted this later. They didn't have more time. And they definitely they definitely needed more time. And more time would have been better. We would have got more. Also, also heard, I saw the original script. You know, that was one of the things that came out. And I like the original script better. Because one of my problems with the game was that because, you know, you know, there was stuff they had to rush. Stuff didn't quite fit like it could have. Like Craven is an amazing villain. The performance, everything was great. But it didn't but it didn't feel like it fit. Because there was so many ways I, th I thought they could have expanded the Craven story, and the more I the more I saw Craven, the more I was like, you know, they really could have used his own game to be the main threat. Because the symbiote saga is just so big. You have a city permit for that bonfire? There's so much you have to explore. With the symbiote saga. I feel like they just didn't have the opportunity to do it as much as they could have. A lot of that could have could have been solved if they had more time for sure. Also, I feel like see what they were to up. fully flesh out Craven, this needed to be like a 50 hour game. Like, like minimum 50, 40 hours. To like really have Craven in there fully fleshed out. For this event? Because having him just. Take out the center, most of the center six life. off screen was just so unsatisfying. But what about the docks? Maybe something there. I feel like there are so many ways they could have really played with the vent, with the Craven thing, built that up. Maybe even have sections where you play as Craven, or play as one of his uh, victims in the Sinister Six. Like there are so many interesting things they could have done with Craven, and it just felt like they didn't have time. That guy needs my help. I would have rather they have saved Craven or something else and just make this mostly focused on the symbiote stuff. Why is Craven doing all this now? People are like, why does the game cost over $200 million? Because they have over five, five. Yeah, like you have. Because the Somniac, remember, Somniac has over 500 people. And they're not just working on entertaining the Venom. They're not just working on, you know, the Spider-Man 2. They're also working on Wolverine, you know, and getting getting other stuff ready. So when you have a team that big, they're working on multiple multiple projects. Then they they're trying to improve the game, like big technical improvements. Cause you know you gotta everyone's gonna complain if the graphics aren't a certain way. Fire, sir, are you okay? 
So yeah, it it can really add up. Shipment to your boss? Oh, great. More of you. You can just tell me where he is. Bang up. Better go check on the dock worker. They did a number on him. Easy, easy. You're in pretty bad shape. Let me help you. Please don't say this is your last stream. Please. I don't know why I would say that. I don't have any plans on retiring from streaming. I thought they were going to kill me. What did they want? Some cargo went missing on the journey. Here. Not unless I suddenly get a billion dollars. And even then, that's just more incentive to stream. You're safe. If I got a huge now, influx of money. The drop off? 718, Kent. It would make me Harry's doing without the suit right now. It would definitely make me more Anybody? take off How some pressure, but I'm fine. then I could just stream whatever I want. <laughs> He's hosting some party at 718 Kent. Now I have to worry. It looks like a social club. Hang on, I'm almost there. Unless you're worried about World War III. Yeah. Oh, he, oh, he took a RPG shot to survive. Those Craven Hunters, the they're built night. tough. Hope our VIP is here. They're more riled up than usual. Just keep your head down. How are you getting in? Kitchen entrance. You should change. The classic Peter Parker look isn't gonna cut it. Too bad my Game doesn't look the dry cleaners. As excited this year, personally. I mean, they don't have as many high-profile releases. But it's still been a pretty great year for gaming. I'm a spy. In 2024, so far. The suit could turn we had Power World, Helldivers 2, Dragon's hey. Dogma 2, hey, Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth. Over here. Take this to Mr. Craven, we, got, we got Stellar Bodyguard. Cake. I mean, Game Stellar Blade. Move. Well, sounds like your shift's starting. Yeah. I'll leave you to it. Xbox is, so is getting some more stuff. Uh, they're getting Indiana Jones and Hellblade 2. We got the Hi Fi Rush. Sea of Thieves for uh, PS5. We're getting the return of uh, multiverses. We got the Marvel Rivals Alpha Test and Reveal. I clean up pretty nice. We're going to have another PlayStation Showcase and all this other stuff. We're getting Black Myth Wukong in the summer. First Descendant. Excuse me. We got Star Wars Outlaws in August. <laughs> Interesting choice. Reminds him of home. We got the Ghost of Tsushima PC, and we just have found out that it has crossplay. PS5 Pro might be dropping. Not to mention game announcements. Like we got, we we still haven't heard from Wonder Woman. That might be a thing. Uh, we could still get the Marvel Venom official announcement, Spider-Man 2 DLC, Ghost of Tsushima 2 announcement. All right, this is going 2024 is plenty for gamers. Mommy's descended. <laughs> so okay. Moving or break your bones. Wolf Among Us 2. I'm not excited for Wolf, Wolf Among Us 2. But I know a lot of people are. You are so certain. Oh yeah. That's Show that's a that. thing. Show him too. Yes. Take it. 
They even should have been a massive DLC, similar to how they say Miles Morales game was going to be released. You don't even know how to use that thing. I'm maybe make that a make that a three part DLC, but I think he just would have fit in the game. Like you could still have this game with Craven in it. Sleep well. But it should have been longer. Hunters were nuts. Like if this game, if this story was fifty out, if this story was forty to fifty hours, I could work with Harry, do the hero gig, and take a vacation all at once. Or just literally, if it was just forty hours for the main for the main campaign, you could com you could comfortably like just thirty four hours comfortably have Craven and the symbiote stuff. They just didn't have the time. Has one of the shield bearers So, it, so uh, if, yes. if anything, the one thing I would they should well, you know Mr. definitely look at going forward this evening, uh, there are some, uh, is to how they can get more out of these games for their big releases. Damn. They got to figure out how to get more out of them shield bearer. Huh. to be like more efficient. And you know, not, not spend as much money, not have to rush stuff. Cause what they had was good. It just there just wasn't enough room. Must be him. And they kind of had to. They kind of had to speed run the third act. What the hell is this? Um, I was told to deliver this to Mr. Kravenoff's personal bodyguard. What makes you think I am him? <laughs> you know, you're uh. Huge. <laughs> Dima is very hungry. You should leave now. So funny. Safe fight would have been huge. Just about to do that. Yeah, like ideally, you you ex you room. expand the Gotta you keep the the, the cut symbio content. You expand the Craven stuff, and then you add some some side con some better side villains. Like they in the trailer, they teased Hydro Man, Big Will, and Speed Demon. Like, if those were side bosses, that would have been that would have been amazing. I don't want to serve him food anymore. Just drop the plate and leave. Simple as that. Coming through. I would have loved for for them to have uh, appeared as a uh, boss fights. That would have been perfect. Ah, this. Add those three. If everything is perfect, give us a look. Give us more Craven. No, 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 wait. Add back in the cut symbio content. And it's and it's great. It's even better. I also like the original ending better. I think I suggested something similar, but I thought Harry should have died. At the end of the game, I thought that was kind of a cop out. I would have preferred Harry die. We find Craven and his weird because it would have made easy to me. It would have made Norman's quest to seek revenge on Spider-Man more believable, especially if it, if he felt it was his fault. Like in my ideal version, I would have had I would have had Norman be Venom. And I would have made Harry the anti venom. You wouldn't happen to be Dima. Crap. Well, that explains the secret menu. Someone's a little angry. But even with Harry as Venom, I would have preferred that he died. That's and beautiful. it was like Peter just had no choice. Right. Let's give Dima something to eat. It was kill Harry must be somewhere. to save the world. But Norman blames P blames Spider Man for for something it. in that study might help me find Craven. But first, gotta break out the apron. He just wants to destroy him. That hunter 
was right there. A meal fit for a Russian tiger bodyguard. That sounded weird. Hmm. I have to make a few minor adjustments to this meal. Where's that sleeping hunter? A lot of bodies by that sleeping hunter. Sleeping. Anyone hear that? Still salty about what they did to Shocker, Scorpion, and Vulture, not to mention the fact that we still haven't seen any other new heroes in New York. That's also true. Like Sleepy time for Dima. They they teased Daredevil again, but they actually took a step up and straight up had Wong interact. But you know, without actually showing them. Hi, Dima. Now I don't know the particulars of their deal with the uh, Marvel and what characters they're allowed to show, but at the very least, I feel like they need to have at least, if they can't show them, have some acknowledgement. Because there are so many heroes operating in New York. Guess Craven's too cool for his own party. Like the Avengers, you can explain away because they're the Avengers. They're they're not New York based heroes. They're glo they're global. They go to different dimensions. Like that makes sense that they're not always around. But other heroes, Daredevil, Strange, must have just missed him. Jessica Jones. Luke Cage, Iron Fist, like to not have any acknowledgement of those heroes at all. When you have like a literal global threat taking over New York, it just felt odd and kind so of a, a immersive tiger. immersion breaking. That tracks. Because because it could even. It, it could have just been like a passing reference. Oh, we're, uh, we oh, there's symbiotes attacking downtown. Oh, don't worry. Uh, there's some guys down there in funny robes doing magic. They're they're handling it like you know just something like that. Just acknowledge that there are other heroes. No serum. These drugs are for late stage chemotherapy. And they're actually doing These something. Cravens too. Dima's terrifyingly adorable. Just adorable. I love. I love Dima. The chapel prepared. Saint Sophia is only a few blocks from here. Craven has to be there with the serum. Time to move. Dima is the cutest. Dima. I think the games are just fine. Oh, that's the thing. I don't I don't want just fine. Everyone should always strive it's to be better. Not what it looks like. I think the hate is definitely overblown. And comes from a lot of, you know, bad faith actors. But okay, suit. See what you can when you're make when you're making games, especially, you don't want to be going backwards in terms of quality.
know, you don't get big, you don't get loyal customers by doing the bare minimum. Then you'll go crazy. Matrix. You're 100% sure that Eddie will put Venom in the Venom game? You're 100% sure? I don't know. Could be Flash. They're both in the Insomniac universe. You should ice that. I don't think the bare minimum is either. I don't think it's bare minimum either, but I thought in some ways it was definitely a step down. But I think I know where he is. And even Insomniac themselves admitted this wasn't their best. Like they didn't put their best foot forward. Promise. That was straight from them. Like they didn't have they they weren't hitting, you know, Sony came to them and told them like this isn't this isn't the you're not hitting the quality that we want. And they admitted that they had they had to scale a lot of stuff down, cut cut stuff they didn't want to cut, especially in the uh, third act. This was not the best they could have done. Where's Eddie's assignment? He works at the uh, bugle. Okay, webs are back. It's you. I knew that was our meat cute back there. I knew it. He signed the letter. I'd love to get to know you better, but I got some business to take care of. When uh, Peter left the bugle, your boss has been up to no good lately. This is my city, not his jungle. He killed Scorpion. Let he signed a letter, being like. And he stabbed me pretty good. Be like, hey, thank, thank you for everything, basically. Oh, 
armor gadget for you. You shall go with the roots. I make sure I save some special abilities for them. That's the key to those brutes. You want to make sure you're saving those uh, special moves. Especially if you can get some... Uh, You get you can get the uh, surge mode then the bruce just become easy enough song and dance i'm coming craven how you jump that high super jump here to pick up a serum order for a Dr. Connors? It's one of the moves in the game. Uh, I think it's called the charge jump, technically. Not the biggest fan of the way spider arms were implemented, which Peter had web base and combo base special moves. I like the web arms just fine, but additional web op base options would have been fun. Cause they ha he has some really cool stuff in Spider-Man PS4 with the suit powers, but then they you know got rid of the suit powers all together. So it would have been nice if they added some of those suit powers to his move set. Like the web blossom. Craven's theme is so good. Saving web abilities for silk. That's po that's definitely possible. I mean, now they don't because well, now Peter, I'm I'm not sure if they'll keep it, but he's got the anti venom now. On top of the metal arms. Say so if you're gonna introduce silk, yeah, you can. Uh, but there's so many web based powers you can give. Like you could get you could have gave Peter a combination of the arms and the web stuff. So there are a lot of different web-based abilities you can give a character. They didn't have that many in Spider-Man PS4. Because he had a lot of tech-based superpowers too. We'll finish this later. There, there's more. There's more than enough room for, for both. Cause like if they're just giving Silk Web Blossom and just all the Spider-Man PS4 special abilities, that's like, that's not going to be as interesting. Harry, MJ, I got the serum. On my way back to Emily May. How'd it go? Really well. Things just got a little intense with Craven. He's somehow stronger than he looks, if you can believe that. Hey, the important thing is that you're okay. And you got the serum. You did great, buddy. I'll start prepping the gear. How'd it really go? It was totally. I didn't want to worry Harry. He has unlimited webbing. It makes sense for her to have web abilities. When it's within range of yeah, and he's Spider Man. He doesn't have unlimited not web abilities, not but he's been Spider-Man for almost ten years. Well, I'm glad you're all right, but he has web abilities, a lot of them. He's a master of webbing. Talk soon. It makes sense for him to have web abilities too, <laughs> which he did in Spider-Man PS4. That's why I'm. That's that's all. That's all we're saying. Like, it looks like these imposter spider bots don't, are com don't completely take them away. Spider stuff. Hey, Yuri. I checked out the old hospital that the flame said he'd be at. It's guarded, but nothing we can't handle. Both of them can have hey, web-based abilities. I still think it's a trap. We need a plan before we go in. Sure. 
There's a rooftop near the hospital. We'll talk there. See you soon. Front the flame. Let's go run the fade with Yuri. Hello, Governor. Sorry. MJ segments were okay, but once they gave her a gun, you love her, especially the family. You tell yourself it's time that casually making the shooter in Spider Man. Yeah, I feel like the Mary Jane stuff was way overblown. Like, MJ was worse in Spider Man PS4. Like, not only were the missions not as good or interesting, it looks like these imposter spider bots are getting There were way more of them. Like, someone else is tracking them? Exactly. I just need to figure out who. Collect any others you can find. I need all the data I can get. There are only three nice missions in Spider-Man 2 where MJ is playable. And Spider-Man is playable in all three of them. And her segments are much better designed. So it's not just pure stealth. A secret hunter base? And Spider-Man trying on his friend's black suit? Things are getting weird out there, folks. I mean, I know there's a lot of excitement about SM's black. Is the new black look, and I mean, it is fire and all, but isn't it just a tad moody for our friendly neighborhood so-and-so? No takers. Just me. Okay, well, you know, you, you come to me for the real real, so I'm just trying to deliver. Stay safe out there, y'all. You skipped Spider-Man 2 so far? I wasn't I wouldn't even dream of skipping Spider-Man 2. I was looking forward to it. I was so hyped when they first announced it back in 2021 there was no way i was not going to play that game and i'm glad i did love love this game as a spider-man fan there was literally no chance i was going to skip spider-man 2. she went in without me i'm going after her They're still breathing. But I don't know if the flame is gonna be so lucky. Not after Yuri said how dangerous he is. We have no idea what their crimson They, they definitely watered down Yuri. She just runs in. This wasn't a part of the prophecy. Trust me. What are you doing, Spider-Man? Like in the City Never Sleeps DLC. They made this whole thing about how Yuri had crossed the line when she, you know, brutally murdered Are that gangster. That's not a good and left the trail leading right to him. But in Spider-Man 2, that doesn't really re reflect what she's doing anymore. Like, she still aims to non-lethally take everybody out. She's just really, she's just really grouchy now. That's that's literally it. Like she's not even a lethal protector. She's just grumpy. That's a map of Brooklyn. Is 
that where the Crimson Hour is supposed to happen? He's less concerned with collateral damage. The Book of Flame. They want the world to burn so they can live oh, this left. This carnage. But she she really isn't what they were building up her to be now? in the in the city and obviously for DLC. What happened to the roof team? You're not in charge. I thought she was gonna be way more brutal. Can't wait for Carnage, same. What's up, gamer? Yuri's behind that rubble. I take out these cultists, I can get to her. And the flame. Carnage is gonna be amazing. Wait. They're making explosives. I love their Cletus Cassidy in this game. They're not waiting for the Crimson Hour. They want to cause it. The world will be cleansed. Don't you know? Only Square show up to parties on time. Where's this Crimson Hour? Is Brooklyn the target? Brooklyn, just the beginning. What do you people want? It's not about what we want. It's about faith. Is that new suit for the flames? Oh, it's for fashion. Now to clear the rubble. New suit swag. Anything about Oscorp? Stop! The fool's beacon himself, as I prophesied. Cletus. No! I knew you had it in you, Yuri. Ooh. There. That'll keep pressure on it until I can. If you want the flame, I'm gonna run the fade. Go through me. Then you're about to swallow a lot of blood. You're going to have to kill him, Yuri. My prophecy says he'll never stop. You just like you. I'll finish you when I'm done. The flame needs to die, Spider Man. The longer he lives, the more people will get hurt. There are other ways to stop him. Less traumatic ways. This path you're on never ends well, Yuri. Trust me. Trust you? What about you trusting me? You weren't there the last time he escaped. You didn't find the body. You didn't see his face. Sorry, I have to do this to you, Yuri. I can't even imagine. But that still doesn't make this right. I am not letting him get away again. I Congratulations, you get to live out the rest of your life behind bars. And I owe it all to you. He tricked you. <laughs> I remember people thought this was, in this scene, people thought that was uh, Eddie Brock. Turns out it was a different well. symbiote host. Cletus. Get out of my way. You know I can't do that. I'm trying to do the right thing. As if you have any idea what that means. Yeah. 
You don't want to do this to you. Everything's blurry. Yeah, prototype three would have been crazy. You care more about being good than doing good. You always have. You used to believe we could do both. Yeah. Then I grew up. You talk like I've never saved anyone. Oh, and nobody died under your watch? I doubt that! You're the one who wanted to wait to come here! If we had followed your plan, the flame would have escaped by now! I know you're better than this! Such a waste of time! You're a fool! And you're not the authority on justice! Why would you be? You're just a man in a costume! Playing hero! I mean, to be fair, you're also in a costume playing hero. Kind of. Got her. Put her right in the trap. Yuri. Still keeping hope for a prototype. Maybe one day. You okay? You need to figure out your priorities. Because I'd rather lose sleep over the one person I killed than all the ones I didn't save. Sounded like the Punisher. I know my priorities. I... I am not going to let the flame hurt anyone else. I'll find him, somehow. I mean, she has a point about Cletus, at least. Though, Spider-Man's New York isn't nearly as bad as Gotham. I mean, it's pretty bad when it comes to prisoner escapes, but not as bad as Arkham. Like, you throw somebody in the raft, usually they stay there. I feel like Cletus, if they just knocked him out and put him in a raft, he would have stayed there. But to be on the safe side, I feel like he's, he's a safe person to get rid of. Like an unrepentant serial, serial killer. Shocking good. Need to stop those hunters before someone gets hurt. And this plan is crazy. The the flame mission chain, yeah, it, it is a side quest. It is uh Peter's uh side quest. Yeah. Carnage Carnage slash Yuri is the Peter exclusive side quest and Mysterio is the Maz Morales exclusive side quest. All the side quests tie into the story. 
that's the I think that's the way they improved on Spider-Man PS4 instead of making just kind of kind of these disposable no consequence side quests they try to have more narrative focused side quests that like go somewhere so like my Mysterio you know is a big villain and they they play that out over the course of a bunch of different missions then for the flame side quest that's going to have consequences in the future so I like how they did that I think that's the way to do it. I would have wanted a little more, ideally. The two broke the play this, but you see everything. Hey, whatever it takes. There are definitely some games where instead of just buying them, me of another great spider I, know. I just watched someone play through it. I actually did that with a God of War Ragnarok. I played 2018. wasn't the biggest fan of it so I just watched an entire playthrough of of uh, Ragnarok in one sitting just all the cutscenes it was good Would have definitely enjoyed it if I had bought it. You can't stop Come on, man. You had to know I'd be here sooner or later. I need a suit like that. I got you, buddy. Nearby. I can take you to it. It's always this guy, too. Thank you. Every time you got to take someone to the ambulance, it's always the same guy. He has the worst luck. Yeah, I might go back. I have so many games in my backlog, but I might go back and get Ragnarok. Cause I want to try it out. I want to try out the DLC. We're almost there. Valhalla. Here you go. Maybe one of now these days. In much better hands. Bless you, Spider-Man. So funny that you're a hit. Take someone who apparently needs medical attention to ER, you're doing backflips and stuff. To be fair, they limit the amount of stuff you can do while you're carrying him. Like, I can basically just swing in a straight line and webs it. So I can't do anything too fancy. I just have so many games to prioritize. Still got it. Let's see what this thing's made of. I'm still, I still haven't. I'm still in the end game of a uh, Dragon's Dogma 2, and I want to do a replay of, of that, a new game plus of that when I when I get finished with that. Okay, 
I've overlaid the serum with an old sample of Connor's blood. If you can destroy the atoms blocking the lizard receptors, we can... Skip this. There. Huzzah! Huzzah. Wait. Does the structure look unstable to you? Here, I still have to, I still have to finish Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Huh. I only did about two hours of that. If we could beam a few electrons in there, it'd stabilize it, but... Then I'm going to play Stellar Blade it. at the end of the month. Particle accelerator? <laughs> That'd be like using a shotgun for a haircut. What's up, King? How you doing, my brother? Way too many games. I want to play Multiverses next month, for sure. See how that game is on the relaunch. Because I really enjoyed the game. I played it like obsessively for like a month straight. But I was really hoping that they made those improvements. Like they definitely needed like a, to overhaul that net code. Pressure change popped in intersection. Like that's everything when it comes to fighting games. And it just it just wasn't there. It's one of the reasons I dropped off from playing. Whoa, 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 whoa! What are you doing? The suit will protect me, right? Peter, I don't know about this. Relax, need a, bet. a good proton. Yeah, like, i hopeful, like, Unreal Engine 5, new netcode. I saw some samples of the netcode in action. Look good, we'll see what it looks like under, you know, non-rehearsed conditions. Well, what's the inside of a but I'm excited. I was a, I was a, pretty much a Batman main. Oh, yeah. I played a lot of Superman, list. but I ended up getting anyway. really into Batman. There aren't any other pressure problems. Nothing. You can come right out. He's just such a good character. I refuse to play with LeBron. Harry! It's, it's powering up, but the beams are at it. Use the magnets to stabilize it. How? Just find the sweet spot. Particle accelerators do not have sweet spots. Superman is your cheat code. Superman was just, it was just so there, satisfying. There's one more set of magnets. To ahead. be Superman and just eat people. The beam, <laughs> the off the map. I got it. Not wipe my library. I like Arya too. Arya is pretty fun. I usually roll with Batman. Almost out. No Superman Slander, it's not acceptable. It's not acceptable. and Shaggy. Yeah, Velma. A Velma team was always pretty tough for someone who knew what they were doing, but yeah, Shaggy was great. Apparently. What happened? Shaggy. Sh people hated Shaggy. The accelerator's still running. And it, it made sense. Like, he was so. Because he was probably the most brainless character in the game. Like everyone would just play Shaggy and just spam the same move. It was just so cheap. Good, good. The static discharges must have fried our fire suppression sensors. I'll try to trigger them manually. Is the antidote still getting made? It was always it satisfying be. to beat up a Shaggy mate. Damage the accelerator, we'll lose it. Stop with the spreading already. I can't wet that fire fast enough. There's gotta be something else I can use. Fire spreading! Not for long! Thank you, loss of thermodynamics. Easy. Nitrogen, always useful. Science!
Harry won't be able to put out the rest of these fires himself. Another fire's out. How you doing, Harry? I'm bypassing every safety lock known to man. Living life on the edge. But I was thinking, there's always one thing that goes wrong with any big undertaking. This was our one. Don't jinx us. There are more fires up here. That's the last of them. Super Saiyan Shaggy. That was such a cool idea. It Super worked. Saiyan Shaggy. <laughs> so you'll power I down. never I refuse All to play with LeBron. I hate LeBron. Connor, <laughs> so there are 67 shutdown steps. If we take it out before then we'll lose the antidote. Oof. Sounds like it's going to be a while. You hungry? I could go get a pizza. Rick and, Mor Rick and Morty were fun too. I'll handle them. No craven? I thought we had a thing going. You are not his only prey. Please, tell me where he is. <laughs> Give it right back. I feel like they could have used a little more balancing. To make, but Morty, Morty was a lot of fun. When he first came out, but Rick was pretty great. Rick was pretty great. Could you not please? I'd like to keep my fight party small. Not Craven was only going after super moves. Why are they here? They must have tracked me after I stole the serum. Sorry, Harry. Why are you apologizing? I'm not worried. You've got the suit. Kick their ass. What step are you on now, Harry? Diverting the beam into the auxiliary tunnel. What's new with you? Well, I just got an extension on my student loans. I'm real excited about that. Student loans. I just I just paid off uh, another one of my student loan bills. We're making good progress. Only and left. and did taxes. Great, because I don't think these guys are gonna stop coming. You got this, buddy. It was a rough couple of days. The reminder for the student loans came right after I had to pay my taxes. I was like, ugh. Down. You ready for the Marvel Rivals playtest? Absolutely not. I do not have a you PC. I can't leave. I'm the only one who can... You're in the Craven mission. He's tough mid boss. I feel like Craven's the only actual tough boss fight in the game. Just genuinely tough, for sure. Especially with Venom because of his very limited move set. But you definitely got to be on your toes <laughs> with Craven. Craven's gonna have fun with you. Harry! Fight's down here, not out there. Want me? Come and get me! Oh, <laughs> 
Get down here. The Yuri's the hardest. I think in terms of difficulty, it's it's Craven. Then a pretty okay, steep drop off. Get down to business, there's something I have to tell you. Then Yuri. I'm fresh out of honey. <laughs> I love this. Man, just yeeted him. I think, I think, I think Venom is harder than Yuri. Come on, I thought it was funny. You know, all this damage wouldn't take long to fix. Maybe we even keep some of it as a patch of on. Oh, crap. Those arrows must have ruptured the accelerator's shielding. The beam scraping the tunnel. Can you still shut it down? What about the antidote? It's still being made, but time to start crossing fingers. I'm sure you hear about Mario again being a shooter. I mean, it's not literally a shooter. Have you not seen the gameplay? Terrific. Definitely check out my videos. I've been doing a lot of coverage of Mario Rivals. I show I show off the gameplay in that in that one. It's not actually a shooter. Oh yes. It's in the hero shooter genre. But it's not literally a shooter. What's up, E team? They just keep coming and destroying everything. Uh, don't worry about that. You need to get out. No, there's just a few steps left. Still finish the editor. I know we can. Yeah. Uh. Hunters, you all should have ran when you had the chance. Someone get on them. So you like smashing things? How about I smash your face? Ooh. Yeah. You're gonna regret ever coming here. How about here. I smash your face? Are you hearing this, Harry? How much longer? I know, I know. I'm on the last two steps. Your first. Clear. Uh, Harry, this place is coming down. We need to leave. No, it'll hold. I'm so close. Right back at him. Welcome back. Was there a spawn video game? There was. A video game, a movie, a t an animated TV series. Let's go. I played and watched all of it. 
Oh, new patch is just dropped. Foundation. I don't care about that right now. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. Get in there and see what you can save. I want a detailed report of the damage. Your dad's right. The foundation doesn't matter. What? This was our dream. And it still is. But right now we have to focus on finding Dr. Connors and getting you. We healthy. can still heal the world. I got this. Pete was definitely yeah, ignoring dude. Miles. Hey, dude. One of the friends got its wires all crossed with an old hunter transmission. Figured you might want to look into it. Maybe it'll lead to Lee. Sending you the source coordinates. Really appreciate it, man. No problem. Everything good? Haley and I are a little worried. It's okay. I just need everything to get back to normal first. I'll make it up to her, though. But for missing her exhibit. Okay, dude. Hope the lead pans out. So let me uh, make sure I can download the patch. Because I got to get my TASM 2 suit fixed. Got to have my TASM 2 fixed. And we'll oh, check out we'll check out the patch notes. Message. Miles, about the stolen museum pieces. I went to the impound yard and saw an old phone number on that truck you chased down. I may be onto something. Can you come meet your mama for lunch at the park by my office? Chop cheese on me. Any clue is a good clue. If we can't find that truck, the museum will have to close. Plus, I never turn out a chopped cheese. Shout out to the chopped cheese. Um, that, that makes me hungry now. Haven't had a chopped cheese in a little bit. Chopped cheese go crazy. All right, downloading this bit right now. While we're doing that, shout out the, shout out the patch notes. Here's the new patch notes. Stability fixes. Just say an issue where masks and lenses on certain suits would appear wavy, notably on the Amazing 2 suit. Just an issue where the webbing on a classic suit appears blurry. Just an issue Peter's Hellfire Gala would have glowing lights around the mask. Just an issue where an orb of light would appear on Peter's Iron Spider suit. Just an issue where some users save data would disappear. Prompt users to start a new game, so they continue with their new game plus. Just an issue where something move across the sky when using the sunset time. Uh, looks like these are mainly 
uh, bug fixes. So nothing, so nothing new. Really, just mainly bug fixes. Bug fixes, stability fixes, fixes for the mask. Live action. Apparently, it's still having issues with casting, and it's going to be a, it's going to be uh, important to have the right character because the animated, you know, animation they nailed it. You know, animation hey, in Genki. the hey dude, one of the friends got its and the insomniac, the insomniac Miles, Naji Jeter, perfect. Spider Verse Miles, perfect. Sending you the source coordinates. Really appreciate it, man. No but for live action, good? yeah. Haley and I are a little worried. It's okay. I just need everything to get back to normal first. Hope they still bring back a uh, Donald Glover. We're missing her exhibit. Okay, dude. As Prowler. The lead pans out. All right, let's uh. Gotta see what's up with that hunter transmission Genki told me about. Hmm. Let's switch to Peter. Here we go. Check out these suits. So they said they fixed the big one. People were mainly asking for was the Tasm 2. Best suit in the game. So let's uh, check out the Amazing 2. Looks good. Get out in photo mode. The amazing two. If they're not doing nothing weird is going on with the eyes anymore. Love it, love it, love it. Uh, let's see what else was there. This the classic suit. Beautiful. It's a classic. There was some moron that said the classic suit looked brown. It was basically brown in Spider-Man 2. I'm like, bro. <laughs> You're actually on crack. <laughs> and they also tightened up the web suit. Which is the Toby, which of course is inferior to the Tasm 2 suit. Looks good. Nothing blurry, nothing wrong with the mask. Oh yeah, and they also, I don't know if I had that issue, but they, they fixed up the, there was an issue with the Hell Gala. Friends of the Danacast, I woke up today with- They said it was glowy around the eyes. So Hell Gala suit. Looks good. Love the suit. They absolutely snapped. With the Hellfire again. Gala suit. Love it. If I was like Miles Oder, just a short buzz cut. They give him a nice fate. Still got battle damage. Yep. Still can toggle battle damage. The battle damage on the Hellfire Gala. The 
bow damage on the amazing two. 2099. All that good stuff. Upgraded classic. One question on my mind. What the hell happened at the Emily May Foundation? I'm actually night? glad they redeemed Dr. One Artavius. Man, we're talking philanthropy and using Same. the means of production for good. And the next we're looking at a war zone. Venom time. Um, yeah, listen, clearly those hunters. I mean, not the actual game involved. yet. Clearly. They're the baddies. Here, but. But yeah, we were just doing. I still I'm just dragging my feet. I'm still doing the new game plus. I think I, I'm I'm definitely going to finish it. Same footage of Spider-Man I did, yeah? The way that new black suit moves, how vicious it is. <sighs> Call me Classic suit is bugged. Worry. Can't change colors anymore. Let me see. Classic suit. You're saying you can't pick the suit styles. Where's the classic? So here's the classic suit. So they don't. There's a new bug where it doesn't display the different suit styles. Yep. Let me see if it's actually Blood, in the game. Nope. Something ain't right. All right. So the new patch introduced a bug. You can't do uh, suit styles for the classic suit. Does it affect any other ones? Nope. Looks like it's for the classic suit. Every every other suit looks like you can you can uh, get your variants, but the classic suit is currently bugged, and you cannot get any suit styles with that one. So that's uh, another thing they'll have to uh, fix later on. He likes Depends Regato. I'm loving it. Yeah, it's, just one, it's just the one, it's just the one light, just the, the Elgato key light. It's just that Stacey one circle, but it's giving me all the light I need. Pretty much. My, my original capture card, I think it's more powerful than this one. The uh, Elgato Neo capture card is meant to mainly be you know just a cheaper easier to set up entry point into capture cards but the key light is great fire department's on its way fyi said you were snitching. Fires. Last fire. I don't think anything's broken. It's just gone. And this guy again. There's an ambulance nearby. 
I can take you to it. Thank you. Change his headphones. <laughs> well, I'm not too heavy. But it's the same guy. We are almost there. Yeah, that whiplash might have hurt him there. And there we are. The pros will take it from here. You really are a hero. Thank you. What's the new update? Mostly bug fix. Pretty much just bug fixes, but they did introduce a new bug. They, it was mainly to fix the problems with the uh, suits, like the Tasm 2, but they broke the classic Spider-Man suit. You uh, currently can't get suit styles, so if you were rocking out the classic and you really were digging some of these suit styles, uh, you were out of luck. You can only pick the one. Other than that, doesn't like anything crazy happen. But yeah, that's <laughs> definitely something they'll, they'll have to send out another uh, patch for. But I'm looking forward to I'm looking I'm really looking forward to the DLC announcement. That's what I'm waiting for. Good chance that happens next month. at the showcase. I think I think I'm a time I think I'm a time it so that I finish my new game plus playthrough like right after they announce the uh, DLC. I'll make sure I I get that uh that playthrough finished so that we're all ready to go in on the DLC. But I'm going to wrap it up. I'm going to go get some lunch. Appreciate everybody hanging out. Shout out once again to Elgato for hooking your boy up with some new gear. I'm definitely going to be rocking out with this uh, key light. I really like this. It's really, it's a it's a really good light. It's super. It's super bright. So it, it can cover the the background just fine for my green screen, but it doesn't actually it's not actually warm. Like it, it's like the problem with lights is that they can get hot. These aren't even hot, so this is good. So I de definitely recommend the key light. Uh, the capture card. If you need a cheap capture card, this the Neo capture card is really good. But if you're a streamer or you do zoom you gotta do zoom meetings for work definitely grab the key light it's it's a dub all right i'll catch y'all next time i'm Set the gamer signing out peace